I'm the managing director for Mambu and Asia Pacific. I've been with the company two and a half years. Joining Mambu, we were two people um, and it was really came in with that fintech mindset really to build our business. We, and we're now we're a team of about 45 in region and we will grow that to a team of about 65 or 70 in the next uh, probably six months or so. Hi, I'm Brian Carroll. I'm the CEO of Tnex and we will be the first digital only bank in Vietnam. It's not about technology, trying to build a digital bank. Fundamentally about culture, particularly in our case, we built two digital banks in nine months. You need a partner that's, that's willing to understand your business model. Culture is actually number one for us because we really are driven by our customer. So we listen to what customers are saying, we listen to what the market's saying, and we try to make sure that we're really sort of keeping ourselves aligned with that. That drives both the success of an individual project, like in Tnex's case, and try and be really proactive from that perspective. A lot of partners hear you, but they don't listen to you. Really, really important about these partnerships um, is they actually stop you doing stupid things. Mambu helped me control my costs, not just on the cloud infrastructure, which is given, but on actually how I, how I deploy. So that's really, really important. Mambu's technology is industry leading. I've known them for a long time. That you can see from the CEO downwards all the way through Miles and his team, there's one culture which is put customer first. Their product is all about putting customer first, but more importantly to me, their relationship with us is about putting customer first. And Brian's right, it's actually not about the technology. It is 100% about the culture. You need to actually in some cases have that right cultural mindset or think differently about how I engage the customer or how I solve a problem. Digital doesn't mean you put in just new tech. What digital means, you actually need to think differently about your customer, how you operate as a business. It is actually all about change. At an industry level, I think there's going to be some interesting movements globally. And Mambo then helped us as well with AWS, with our Amazon partners, our TechX partners, and some of our SI partners to actually drive that message, message through. So they're actually very proud of what they have. And because Mambo very much has a philosophy of the customer is in control of their own destiny, this composable banking philosophy is something that will really allow us to continue to go where our customer needs us to go, allow our customers to wrap whatever they want around us to create and be driven by their end customer. We really believe in that philosophy and will continue to do so going forward. To be quite open, you know, when we talk about our partners, we get quite emotional now because we're so damn grateful that they let us go off and do crazy crap.